This episode I'll be talking about the adhesives we carry at Blue Ryan and how you can use them for different bonding applications depending on the substrate or the material you're trying to bond. So the glues we carry at Blue Ryan can be used for a variety of different applications but the majority of our product range that we have today is mainly for acrylic applications and depending on the acrylic application you're trying to do and the, the final result you're trying to achieve each glue has its pros and cons. So going through it this the first product general purpose acrylic instant adhesive so this is what uh, most of our fabricators use for general purpose bonding of acrylic uh, the advantages of this product is especially for bonding lower thickness sheets it's ex extremely fast so when you're doing 6 mm 3 mm acrylic uh, sheets thickness, thickness of sheet 3 mm or 6 mm is extremely fast in bonding uh, in setting the the bond between the two pieces of acrylic but one of the disadvantages is that when you do that bonding, usually at the line of the bond, you would see a lot of glues and tracing marks or, or, or white lines. So only along the edge where it is bond. So if you have a 3mm bond, a 3mm piece bonded to another sheet, on that part you would see tracing and scratch and essentially scratches underneath the bond only. So that is one disadvantage when you're using these instant acrylic adhesives. But for many applications, that's probably not a big deal because no, people are not inspecting the piece so closely and don't uh, uh, mind that. And when they want to do it really fast, this is a great product for that. It comes in 2.5 liter bottles like this. It is also hazardous, so it's extremely important that fabricators, when they're using this, use um, either uh, masks and gloves when they're using it. And ideally, uh, we'll use will take out the glue with a syringe like device and also place it lightly on the surface. So this is our instant acrylic adhesive, very commonly used. And the next three products are the Acrifix range of ac acrylic glues. These are made by Evonik. This is a leading chemical company who also manufacture the plexiglass range of acrylic sheets. So they have chemically uh, engineered these products so that they are ideal for a variety of applications and uses. So the first product is the 190. 190 Acrifix is a two component acrylic adhesive. So this is the top of the line acrylic adhesive if you are going to use it for architectural bonding. So when I talk about architectural bonding, I'm talking about balustrades, aquariums, uh, really applications where the structural bond of the acrylic it plays a vital role. Uh, swimming pool part partitions, where you have, or large scale aquariums, you need a bond that is going to ensure that the pressure of the water or weight of uh, maybe in staircases with people walking by over it is not going to affect the bond it is structurally strong so this is a product that is uh, a very viscous liquid you have to mix it with a catalyst so generally the measurement works out to 97 percent of uh, 190 to 3 percent of uh, catalyst so once it is combined then the polymerization process starts and then you have to bond it together, to place it in the bond, and then once it hardens, it is completely polymerized. It's actually like a new, newly bond, bonded piece of acrylic. There's a, a lot of tips and tricks and other YouTube videos also you should watch about the uh, intricate way you have to mix it and apply it, because that's very important when you're trying to achieve a high quality finish. The next product is a general purpose product from uh, Evonik. It is uh, 127, so this adhesive is a solvent based adhesive for acrylic specifically. So this also, like I said, general purpose, but unlike the first product, it, uh, that which also sets fast, this sets fast too, but you will not, you will have very little crazing on the bonding surface, it'll all be, be almost clear. And it's I, again, ideal for uh, lower thickness acrylics, whether it's 3mm, 6mm or 10. The first, this product, the 190, you can use it for blocks. When I mentioned aquariums, thick, 30 mm, 50 mm blocks, this is the ideal product for that. Or even uh, lower thickness where you want that structural bond. This is lower thickness, instant setting with minimal to no crazing when you use this product. And th when the surface is uh, perfectly clean, you have better results, especially when you use this to have no crazing or marks in the, in the bond. This other product, the 192, single component acrylic adhesive for, again, you can achieve very strong bonds with this product. Uh, the one caveat is that when you use it, once you place the glue in the, in the two pieces you want to join together, you then have to use UV light 
to start the polymerization process for it to harden. So this product, uh, generally our fabricators would use uh, a, have a dark room where they have UV lights in place so that the bond would start to polymerize and harden. Some people even just place the bonded pieces outdoors in adequate sunlight and UV light we have outside and there it polymerizes and sets. So again, all the Acrifix products, a lot of great YouTube videos and for tips and tricks from experienced fabricators, you can uh, watch how they use it. And uh, these are all available in one liter or one kilogram bottles. The next product is a, a super glue adhesive or some people know it as a cyanoacrylate adhesive. This cyanoacrylate adhesive, we call it the sign bond adhesive. So it's a very general purpose super glue. This product is exactly the same composition or chemical composition as the super glue you find at usually the supermarket checkout counters in the tiny little tubes. The only difference is that that is highly uh, viscous or very, very uh, thick and this is more watery. So the advantage is that this will, especially for fabricators, it gives them a little uh, cushion in terms of time to for the bond to set in case they need to do some minor readjustment before bonding. So this is a general purpose uh, super glue. Again, our customers use it for PVC based materials, for uh, metals, woods, uh, acrylic even. It's a great general purpose super glue. Comes with a little uh, add-on uh, piece that you can stick to the nozzle as well so that you can uh, modulate how much material com glue comes out onto the material so you don't make a mess of it. The next product is the UV glue. This is our UV glue that's made from uh, made in Taiwan. It's a great product for acrylic bonding also. It also will polymerize or harden only uh, once you introduce UV light to it. Uh, unlike the Acrifix glue, this might take a little bit longer to set, but the bond is equally hard, uh, stronger. It's great for clear materials especially. The last and the strongest of all are glues, especially for multi uh, purpose materials. So when we're talking about wood, metal, glass, this is a great product. This is a clear, uh, uh, all, we call it Sudol All Fix. It's a clear adhesive. So especially if you're doing something like that you want to fix on, uh, say like we fix uh, small metal brackets onto glass, you don't want to see any uh, dirty bonding marks. This is a great product to just apply it in little uh, drops and then place it on the glass. Within 24 hours, it has a complete set and bond. When you place it on the glass itself, it will have an immediate tack and hold, but the complete uh, strength of the bond will set only after 24 hours. But it's a great all-purpose adhesive for uh, wood, metals, uh, even as a sealant. It's an MS polymer-based MS polymer uh, adhesive and great for all-purpose use. So please look up on the data sheets on our website for these products. You can get even more in-depth information. We can uh, point you towards more YouTube videos that you can also get more tips and tricks on using them. But most importantly, if it's your first time using any of these glues, it's very important to buy it, test it out, and try it for different applications because uh, there's a lot of skill involved to especially achieve great finishing when using these kind of glues and adhesives. I hope this was interesting. If you'd like to know more about it or have any questions, please comment on this video and uh, let us know what other glues you're using today. Maybe we can add in our range.